This one's called Malcolm. You remember Malcolm? That serious cat from the 60s? Black suit, dark glasses, black power revolutionary, gathered crowds, fists raised in the air. He spoke of guns while others marched for peace. He renounced his name, called his God Allah, Islam, his nation, gave him someone to blame. Like all Muhammad's sons, Malcolm fell to yearning to take a journey. To Mecca, he was bound. Along the passage, among the crowds, he looked around and hung his head to the ground. On praying knees, he could barely breathe while he began to comprehend while all called him. His mind resisted what his eyes could not ignore. At the foot of the mountain, he did weep. By the prophet, Islam may be my nation, but by Allah, it has no race. After he prayed among Muslims of all shade, shades, his words changed. And while he praised Allah for showing him the light, his nation revolted, for hate had given him the power. And with his new words, he was taking it away. But nothing would persuade him, not the anger nor the danger. Allah has spoken, his duty shown, he couldn't walk away. Guns now protected his family, from the revolt of his nation, for all his calls superseded the power of his nation. A cold day, February 1965, backstage on Broadway and 165, Malcolm hugged his children close, kissed his wife, then stood at the podium to raise his voice to its elegant timber, to praise Allah for the grace, to look each of them in the face, to share how the prophet had shown him the way. Please hear me or take the journey. See, is, see what Islam is about. You will see that Islam isn't just shades of brown. Fall to your knees, shed your tears and shame for listening to me hate. Now before bullets tore through Malcolm's chest before he could finish the rest, he left Audubon in an ambulance dead on arrival at Presbyterian, 39, he was gone. You remember Malcolm, that serious cat from the 60s? Black suit, the dark glasses, black power revolutionary, had everyone stunned when he spoke of love, took a bullet from his nation. It's funny though, that's when y'all stop listening. <laughs> This is, this is one of my favorites. It's called Try. I'll not look too deeply in your eyes or watch the way you move too closely. I'll make sure to calm my heart at the sound of your voice, to look away when your smile is only for me. I'll erase all thoughts of you from my brain, wash your taste from my mouth. I promise not to close my eyes, kiss you too deeply, or wrap my legs around you too tightly when we make love. I won't get too comfortable in your arms, sleep too deeply, or fall in love. Let me try. I'll show you. Thank you. <laughs>